What's going on YouTube? The Independent Stacker coming to you again tonight, March 12th, 2019. As of 11 p.m. this evening, Eastern Standard Time, gold is at 1307.81, silver is at 1553, with giving us a ratio of 84.22. What is this? This board. We got a lot of numbers here. I mean, Dow Jones, the yen, federal debt. So many things listed on this board. Why? Well, I'll tell you why. Because all of these things actually directly and sometimes indirectly affect what us in the stacking community are trying to do. And that is gauge where silver pricing is going to be in the future. All of these things listed on here in some way or another boil down to how silver pricing, gold pricing, and that ratio, those three magic numbers that we watch every single day go up and down. So we're going to change up the format for these videos just a little bit. As we've talked about, I'm a numbers guy. All of these numbers are numbers that I am now watching daily, multiple times a day, watching them go up and down. So the way we got them listed on here, green, obviously, numbers are going up. And red, numbers are going down. Uh, we're also going to do a, a, a episode shout out. Every episode, we're going to pick another uh, stacker in the community that's been, uh, that I've been interacting with on either my comments or on a live feed that I might be uh, on with somebody else. Uh, if there's anything else that you guys think that I should add to this list, please let me know down in the comments. I'll be more than happy to include that on this list. Um, you know, I'm only going to list this one time uh, or talk about this one time and the rest of the episodes, you're just going to have to know that this guy right here is a joke. If you guys get the joke, great. Go ahead and comment with a little little happy face or a little little crying because you're happy face down in the comments. But I uh, feel like that one is uh, pretty good. So um, these numbers up here at the top, I'm not going to go over these. That's just eye candy for when you get bored looking at uh, what I'm playing with down here. And tonight, that happens to be some Morgan Dollars. I went to my local coin shop. Um, the random chance that they might have some bars, they did not. Or some American Silver Eagles, which they did not also have those. Uh, so I picked up these. Um, got 10. These are all uh, the same year. Uh, obviously, somebody had dropped off a couple tubes of 1921 Morgan dollars. So I got 10 of them. Uh, I got these for 16 apiece, which I felt like was more than fair. Uh, some of these have some really cool coloration on them. I was really happy with how uh, some of these were uh, toned. This guy here, kind of get some light on that for you. Um, yeah, I was really happy with uh, this purchase. Uh, we're adding some more junk silver, although this is... Uh, Quite a bit over the price that you would expect to pay for junk. Um, these are pretty much coal, coal, coal quality, I would say. Um, but yeah, I really like this one. This one had some really good coloration on it. Um, obviously, uh, there's uh, several here that uh, had some good color. So, what do you guys think? Do you guys um, collect Morgans? I know there's a, kind of a cross-section of people here in the stacking community that... Um, some of you guys really like the Morgans. Some of you guys think that the Morgans are um, maybe not the best thing to get because we pay pretty close to what we pay for an actual ounce of silver as far as a bar or American Silver Eagle. Um, so let me know down in the comments uh, down below. Uh, as always, the like button over here. Uh, appreciate those likes, guys. Let me know that you're watching. Uh, also, the subscribe button down on this side. Tell your friends, tell your family, maybe get a dog, uh, get them an account for YouTube and get them signed up as well. Um, 
But that's it for tonight. Uh, we've got a couple packages coming in uh, later this week, so hopefully we'll get uh, a little bit more content out for you guys here over the weekend. Independent Stacker telling you that if the women don't find you handsome, they should at least find your pockets heavy.